Hello, 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 hello. Okay. Happy Independence Day. And ah! Just Hey, we'll go back to our stupid reactions. <laughs> it's up, Gorpin. I'm deaf. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> You can follow us on Instagram and Twitter for juicy content. <laughs> Thank you to every sports on Patreon. Follow us on Twitter account. Subscribe and hit that like button. Make sure you're right here. Uh, I don't so, want to put my head close to you now. Oh, yeah, you do. Uh, uh, welcome back. Today we're doing a movie review of the new released, just today, uh, 2024 sequel of the comedy horror universe of Stray in Stray 2 is what we will be reviewing. Um, obviously, we had been, if you haven't seen our review of Stray, we saw that many years ago. Yeah. And then rewatched it just yesterday. I yes. Think you were watching yesterday yes, yes. as well. Uh, for, for a refresher on the story. Um, and so if you haven't seen that, please go watch our review and Bedia as well. Yep. Uh, part of the universe as well. Um, so you can go watch both of those reviews. Um, this will be Mostly non-spoiler, just because it's a new film. That's how we work when it's new films. If it's not a new film, then it's all spoilers, baby. Um, but it'll be mostly non-spoilers. If we do get to the spoils, we will tell you before we do that. But it's starring all of our ghosts. I'm th I think every single one, actually. <laughs> I think it's every single one of our ghosts. Um, and then directed by Amir Kush Kushik, Kushik, maybe? Written by Naren Bhatt and uh, starring Shraddha Kapoor, Raj, uh, Rajkumar Rao, uh, Pankaj Tripathi, uh, Abhishek uh, Banerjee, uh, AK, because I can't pronounce his name, and uh, a, a couple other people. But uh, once again, if you haven't seen it, please go watch it and come back. This will be non spoilers. Wait, you can watch it if you haven't seen it, because we. It's, Okay, Rick, your initial non-spoiler <laughs> thoughts of Street 2. Yeah, the old Michelin star adage that if you've gone to a place as a Michelin raider and uh, you have nothing nice to say, you don't say anything at all. I have nothing nice to say. <laughs> Short review. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this was a uh, definitely a disappointment, and it, it definitely it fell into, at least for us... English speakers, obviously. Um, the bad sequel trap. That's just what it felt like. It felt like a bad sequel. Um, and I, I, all I've actually heard is actually praise for the movie so far. So you guys will have to tell us uh, what what is different for you. Oh, because it's doing well at the box office. I don't know why. Because I haven't watched any of the. No, reviews. that's the that's the criteria, man. If it does well at the box office, it's a good movie. I haven't seen any of the reviews because I wasn't going to watch a review before I saw the movie, obviously. Right. But in terms of like people on Twitter, uh, all I've seen is praise so far. Um, the biggest, biggest, biggest issue for me is, man, did I feel like they. And that was my fear. I think I said it multiple times in the trailer, is I, I, I didn't want them to lose track of who they originally were as a movie. And I just watched, I rewatched Stree, and there weren't as many laughs as I remember um, in the, in, like when I watched it the first time. Um, I, rem I In my mind, I remember laughing all the time, and, and I probably was laughing more than I watched it the, the second time, but it wasn't like a laugh, 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 laugh. No. Um, and many of the laughs were small. Yeah, small. Um, they were very they, close to the vest. Close to the vest, and uh, they in stuck, the original street, they stuck to the uh, the story um, kind of stuff. Man, did they really just throw everything at the wall and see what stuck? I guess because they were trying to make everything a joke, and that's where the writing really failed. Is they like every single line they were trying to be funny. Uh, the writing is what I'm saying. Um, and making it bigger than the Three Stooges. Yeah. And the first one was silly. I'm not saying the first one wasn't silly. It was a silly film, of course. But, man, did they make it, like, almost into, like, a, a clown show. Because, like, it was like, it, like, they never took themselves seriously. Um, the, I'm talking about the, the writing of the film. They never took themselves seriously. Everybody was making a joke. The villain was making a joke. Uh, 
Um, and like, I was like, if you don't take yourself seriously, how am I? And like I said, I'm not saying that Street was a, like a, like the serious serious. It was a comedy, of course, it was a comedy. But it, uh, it, it 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 was fun. Yeah, and it actually had a little heart. Yeah, and Bedia did as well. Bedia wasn't even nearly as funny yeah. as um, uh, Street. Right. But it had heart. Right. Man, did they lose sight of that, right? Oh. Um, yeah. Almost intentionally. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I was having an okay time in in kind of the uh, first three-fourths of the first half. I was having an okay time. I was like, okay. They said, and then, man, but in the second half, did it go into off the rails even more so uh, territory of like, okay, this is... Uh, yeah. Like, Bedia seemed like it was in the same universe. This does not seem like it's in the same universe. It's it not. felt like they wanted to be a superhero movie. That, uh, yeah. That was, like, Among the many, many mistakes yeah, they yeah, made. Yeah, yeah Among course. the many mistakes they made, that is one of them. <laughs> but, right? It, yes. Like, the identity wasn't there. No. At all. At all. Um, and that's a, a grave mistake, in my opinion. Um... I'm fully open to that. There were, there were times that other people, I'm assuming Hindi speakers, were laughing at things that we were not. Not at, not like an insane amount. At but the they, beginning of the film. Uh, I heard it some in the second half as well, but not like an insane amount. Like nobody was in, in, in like fits or anything like that. But there were times. Um, and so I'm, I'm fully open to the fact that uh, some of it might have been. The couple to our right left at the climax. Well, the, well, the, I don't know the guy, why, but. The guy fell asleep. Oh, yeah. Well, he, he was snoring. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> he was that, that was, tells you a lot. In, in fact, uh, we just watched a movie earlier today about <laughs> <laughs> about a very yes. simple story. Yeah. Uh <laughs> a good story. With, yeah. Um yeah, and that uh, obviously I don't want to just like hash into everything. The biggest do you not uh, do you think that the biggest issue is what I what I said is like that they wow, they the, lost sight like the writing, of course. Yeah. Would be the like what were you doing? Why does yes. why does every single line have to be a punchline? Yes, and why why didn't you come up with any kind of a semblance of a story that anybody cared about or made sense or even seemingly came from the world of Street before, other than just some thoughts you had, and literally, like you said, just threw stuff on the wall, and if something stuck, we're gonna use it. Yeah. Um. Very strange. It was. It it, it was. It was, I mean, I have nothing to say. <laughs> I'll add as a little button on the end of it. It was insultingly bad. <laughs> it was insultingly bad. Which? Um, and, and, and I don't know why. <laughs> I don't, it boggles the mind because we give so much open, I try so hard to like a film. I don't want to dislike a film. Uh, especially when it has anybody in it that you've you've had a conversation with, it's like going it's like going to a play with somebody in it that you know, and it's it's just tremendously awful. I, I I'm not the kind of person who can go backstage and say what a great show. That's lying. I, it's yeah. just I'm not gonna do it. And and this was this was tremendously awful. Yeah. Yeah. It was um, the uh, and it was it was crazy because. You had Street, which was great. A great film. Right. Uh, and a funny film. Um, and it had some it, horror elements that it took itself seriously in that aspect. And then Bedia came along, and you're like, oh, we got a nice little universe a little, here. little and comedy horror universe. Wait, I, I, I think Street is better than Bedia, but I think Bedia was also quite good. Uh, I enjoyed it. it I would worked. watch Bedia again. It worked. Um, and then this happened. Uh, yeah. <laughs> It like doesn't feel the same. Uh, and was was Raj and DK? I know they were the writer. Were they the writers on the original? I believe they were. They were definitely the producers, and I kind of understand why they weren't a part of this. Um, let's see, Stree, but they weren't a part of Bedia. So Not to my knowledge. That wasn't the but... and the, uh, the the director of Bedia is this same director. Um. Uh. So the hold on. Okay, Street the original. Is hold on, is this director the same director as the original? Let me see. It is. Wow. Okay. That's crazy. Yeah. But the, the writing credits though. Um, cause that 
I mean, there's other issues. I'm not saying that that's the only issue, but it has that is the uh, a lot. That is the biggest issue for me. Is, it is yeah. the writing of it is the, is the biggest. Issue. The original writers are Raj and DK, mm. along with Sumit uh, Armoria. I don't know who that one is, but um, I know the the director wrote I think Bedia as well. Um, and so I had a lot of hope that okay, we're going to continue at least that style, right? Um. Yeah, man. It was, uh... I genuinely don't have one thing I can say positive about it. And that's not just trying... I'm, I'm not a hater. I'm not somebody who purposefully tries to say things negative. How or can we be a hater? Say, right? We've interviewed... Say, we've, like, uh, the, the, we have six say things to be <laughs> Right. Say, say th I say things from the heart. I, I, there was nothing about this movie. It was... It was... There you have it. I've said it. <laughs> Yo, how could we be a hater about this? We literally have six dosed in yeah, this film. I came in, <laughs> I came in rooting for this film. Rooting for it. I feel like I went to a Dodger game and just watched them make 17 errors and lose by 25 points. It was just that disappointing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, if you watched it and, and you liked it, Please let us know uh, what um, you liked. And, like, me, if you know the disconnect where that came from for us, uh, <laughs> and what you think the reasoning was, I'm all ears for it. Um, doesn't change my opinion, but I would, I would love to know your, your thoughts on it um, because I want to understand. <laughs> I want to understand what happened uh, in a film that I like. This was might have been my most anticipated film of the year. One of, yeah, at least in the top five. Absolutely, the sequel to Shree. Yeah, yeah, that was uh, it, very. I was excited about the sequel to Shree to Shree when we did the review for Shree, and you said, yeah, apparently there's a sequel in the works. Yeah, I've been excited for it since then. Was it four <laughs> years ago or something. Yeah, like four years ago. God damn. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have much else to say. Uh, we were disappointed. Not much else to say. Not much that. else to say. Uh, you can let us know what you thought about uh, the movie Street 2. Uh, if you liked it, if you didn't like it, why? Let us all know all those, please. Um, and uh, anything else I guess we need to know down below? Can't win them all. <laughs> Just